What does Y do in Vim? Y yanks things, and it's more or less like copy. Welcome back to this short series on Vim, where we're covering the alphabet in Vim A to Z. I'm Chantastic, and today we're talking about Y. Y is how we copy text in Vim, and it's called yank, or it stands for yank. Uh, so you would yank text instead of copying it. Uh, let's dive into our editor. We will open up the uh, quick brown file today. Now, the first thing about Y is that you can um, use it with a motion. So we can do Y to the right, and that will copy into our register this one right here. Now, to paste, we use P, which we've learned before. Um, if we want to paste it before the one that's already there, um, we can do a, a capital P. And uh, if we want to undo that and paste it, I'm sorry, after, uh, we can use a lowercase p. Now, the key is, is that we used a motion, so we just said right to copy the character under our cursor. Now, we can yank words using other motions, so we could do y end to yank this word, and if I paste that um, in front, now we have two thises. Let's undo that. The next use of y is two y's in consecutive order, so y, y. Y, y will copy an entire line. Uh, and we can hit paste and it will paste that line below the line that our cursor is on. So pretty easy command there. Y, Y will do that. Now, all of these commands typically have a capital version too. And capital Y will do the same thing as Y, Y. It's an alias. So I did capital Y. And if I hit P, um, it's going to insert that below. Now, this command is configurable. And you can see how so in the help documentation. Um, and you can configure it so that it will copy to the end of the line from your cursor. Um, that can be useful. I don't personally use it. I really don't like a lot of configuration, but that's something that you can do. Finally, Y also works with visual selections. So if we hit V to get into our visual selection mode, hit E a few times to get to the end of words, uh, we can hit Y and um, P will uh, insert that visual selection that we made. We will undo that, and uh, if you have any questions, you can do uh, the command colon help to find uh, help or H for short and type Y. Uh, that will give you all of the documentation for Y. Uh, you'll see all the commands that we covered here today. Uh, additionally, with um, information on how to configure capital Y to go from the cursor to the end of the line. That's all I have for you today. I am so excited that we finally covered Y because it is so valuable all the time um, being able to copy something without having to first delete it. Tomorrow we're covering Z, which is the last letter that we're going to cover. I can't believe we made it all this way and more so I can't believe that it took me so long to make my cursor pink so it would stand out more. I, I barely know what I'm doing, but I'll see you tomorrow with Z.